Won't you be my plug, ayy? You could be the one, ayy. Get start with a handshake, baby. Hey, if you're new to my channel, my name is Sharnika M. Please like, comment, and subscribe. I really do appreciate it. You're a returning subscriber. Hey. So, hey, y'all. How y'all doing? I hope you guys are doing well. You guys had a great week. Um, I can't complain. I had a decent week, you know? So, we're at Sam Club. Not only at Sam Club, you guys are here with me to stock up my home, add to my stockpile. We're getting non-perishable items today. We're definitely grabbing water. And I'm going to show you guys some tips and tricks on how to add to your stockpile if you are on a fixed income or just a tight budget. So, do not freak out. I got your back, okay? So, over here, we're going to stay ready so we won't have to get ready. So, do you guys have a stockpile? If you have a stockpile, what do you have in your stockpile? Let me know down in the comments below because you may have something that I don't have and I may need to get. So, y'all, let's go inside and I will see you guys so, in a second. y'all. Now, I know different states, um, stores, shelves are not like packed or anything. I can't speak for y'all, but our Sam Club is packed so yeah so we about to get some water because i haven't got any water i actually been slacking and we gotta stop doing it so we're gonna grab two cases we're not gonna be greedy we actually gonna look out for other people so they have ice mountain water aquafina pure life purified water and yeah, and then they have like the other waters back over there too. I don't know the price to the corn, but I did grab more corn. Mushroom is eleven thirty-eight, and then I end up grabbing the Marie Calendar soups, and that's ten ninety-eight. We're gonna scan down here, and we're gonna grab some macaroni and cheese, right? So I'm gonna get a box of these. You can never go wrong with getting a uh, pasta sauce. So I definitely say to add in your stockpiles, get pasta sauce and it's $7.82. So I'm gonna grab one of these. Okay, y'all, the reason why I love Sam Club is because of their pasta. So it's $7.94 for the Barilla. I believe that's how I'm pronouncing it. But I really say just adding your stockpile is get these because six of them come in a pack and I feel like it's well worth it. And you can save so much. I say get anything like pasta, rice, anything that you can make a little bit and it could be made a lot of. So definitely grab some pasta. That's like a big tip I'll say to add if to you stockpile. have children to make it easy. So these is the easy mac and cheese cups. And I would say grab a pack. Like, really grab a pack just to be on the safe side. Because, you know, kids, sometimes they don't want to eat all that. And what I would do, i split this with my kids. If I could find one that's not all tore up. So, this is definitely good to add to a stockpile as well. I'll grab these Velveeta because, I mean, like I said, if you're going to start a stockpile, definitely grab, like, noodles and rice. That's going to be your best friend to survive. But, I mean, you don't have to get name brand stuff. But if you can afford it, I'll say go for it. Y'all, okay. So, the noodles. They're four forty-eight, right? I'm going to grab two boxes of noodles because, I mean, if, listen, we're talking about surviving. Noodles is going to be your friend. Definitely add this to your stockpile as well. I would say grab noodles. Definitely grab noodles, okay, y'all. I love these beans, they're really good for like tacos and nachos. I don't eat meat like that, so yeah. But I would say add this to your stockpile as well because I mean, beans like, come on now, okay, you guys. Now, I would really say to add to a stockpile, I would say get this rice, this helps as well. And I will also say if you can grab a bag of rice, that would be your best friend. Because one thing about rice, you can always make a handful, like a cup or two, and you can eat off of that for a week. So they have different types of rice. I would definitely say grab rice. Like that's the most smartest survival move you can actually do is grab rice. So 
I'm going to grab two of these. I'm going to grab two of these rice, right? We, got we may go up in Walmart too because there's some things that I want to grab and I want to show y'all. So we're probably about to just leave Sam Club because I actually want to go to Walmart and there's some stuff I do want to grab as well. But I found the Ritz crackers. So you definitely want some crackers in your stockpile too. I really suggest that because that comes in handy. It's crackers, like crackers, it don't even have to be Ritz crackers, just crackers in general in your stockpile. Like that really helps with you know, surviving. We talking about surviving here, y'all. Been messed up. I'm in the like sweets aisle, and these kids, Lord, <sighs> I messed up. I really did mess up. Yes, he spotted the sweets. Yes. Oh, y'all. I'm gonna show y'all what he's talking about. What he wants, and we got a big old bag of candy in the house. And I'm gonna show y'all what he's talking he about. He wants this, and it's like we got a big bag of candy at home, but it's like I don't know. Should I get it for him? I might end up getting it for him. So this is what he okay, wants. Okay, y'all. We're at Walmart, and I am going to go inside and get some things. But I'm going to get some things that everybody can go grab because a lot of people don't have sam club memberships and a lot of people is not trying to pay for that membership so i'm definitely going to consider that and be considerate to those who don't have sam club memberships um i got y'all back trust me i got y'all back y'all don't have to get the name brand things that i got um i just grabbed the things that my kids will eat and um so i'm going to consider that you know i'm not gonna just focus on sam club i'm going to actually go to a store that everyone is familiar with and can get to because everybody don't have a membership everybody don't have the money to pay for a membership so i'm definitely looking out for those people as well um you know i thought about that i had to kind of check myself like girl you need to kind of go somewhere where everybody else can go so i, I apologize about that so we're gonna go inside of walmart and let's go we ain't gonna be in here long because my trunk show everything i got and i'm gonna be real mad so we ain't gonna be in here so so for my families that's like on a fixed income for your stockpile they have macaroni and cheese for 43 cent so i'm gonna grab three I'm gonna grab three of those. And then I'm just showing y'all the other stuff they have. Okay. So, again, you know them cup noodles I showed y'all in Sam Club? They have some, like the great value kind. And definitely grab those. These are $2.72. So here they go, if you're interested. So I'm gonna probably just grab okay. one, y'all. So. If you can, I would say grab these Velveeta bowls because all you got to do is heat it up in the microwave. My kids love these, especially those lasagna ones, I would say grab. So I'm just going to grab this one. And uh, they're not too crazy about the bacon one, so I'm not going to grab that one. Oh, uh, yeah. They also like these as well, these dinners. So they definitely love the beef pot rolls, so I'm gonna grab two of these. And then, I will definitely say if you can, definitely grab the beef stew and add it to your stockpile. So I'm gonna grab two of these. Definitely gonna grab two of these. I really say grab them. And my children also like the Swedish meatball, so I'm gonna grab one of these. And I'm gonna grab this one as well. So they have a lot of canned goods. Like I say, every state is different, so it just really depends yes, on what state yes, you're at. Yes. Really say go for like the sweet potatoes. So I'm gonna grab this one, two of these. So y'all, so if you're a family and you got big, like a lot of kids, I would say grab something like this. These are a dollar. So I'm gonna grab two of these. Can't go wrong with that. these potatoes as well. So I'm gonna grab the these. I'm gonna grab these. 
I'm going to grab these and I'm definitely going to grab these. You can't never go wrong with this. This is a really, really good thing to put in your stockpile. Really, really good thing because they're easy and quick. Guys, noodles. I will grab two packs to add to my stockpile because like I say, noodles is like the most smartest thing you can ever keep. So we're going to grab two of these. They have a lot of canned soups. A lot of soups, actually. Um, a lot of soups. So this is what they had, y'all. Okay, so they have beans and here go the rice right here so we're gonna grab some rice so the rice is 137 so this is brown rice and I'm gonna grab two and this is what I have so far so yeah y'all water they have so far because see y'all the water don't really last here so I'm gonna grab two cases of the ice mountain water I only got one case because that water is making my car actually heavy so we'll come back and get some more but um we are definitely gonna be going shopping again I'm just showing you guys ideas on what y'all can get Especially when you have a bigger family and you can't go to Sam Club, this is the way crackers. to go. Crackers. If you don't want to get the Ritz crackers and you're on a tight budget, I would say get the saltine crackers. Or you can get these crackers. You know, it just depends on your household, y'all. But I'm just saying, right now, we're not in a time to really be picky. So I just say grab what you get and grab what you You want to beat the stores before the panic shoppers do. Because the panic shoppers don't care about nobody but they self and their household. So I say whatever you see, grab it. I also say grab these as well. So I'm going to grab a few of these. I'm going to get this one. I'm going to get this one. Um, and I'm going to get this one. So if you don't want to buy like the hamburger helper, you can get the Walmart brand. So I really say grab these. Like I said, y'all, big family, you want to be on a budget. You definitely would grab, you know, grab these, y'all. Grab these. Canned goods is, like, going to be your best friend. Like, if you can't afford the name brands, get the great value one or the store brands. If you can't, you know, when, if you don't care to get name brand, it really don't matter. It's just all about starting the stockpile, right? So, I'm just showing y'all what we get. Okay? Hey, you guys. So, this is becoming to the end of the video. But I want to share with you guys how much I actually spent at Sam Club and Walmart. To show you guys the difference. So, you can make a decision on whether if you want to go to Sam Club or Walmart. Or you guys can go to both. And we're gonna do more stores. It's not gonna just be Sam Club and Walmart. We're gonna go to Aldi's, Kroger's. We're gonna go to a lot of places. Steph, definitely Whole Foods, especially for my people who are vegetarians or vegans. I got y'all. So let me let y'all know what I spent. So Sam Club, I spent $186.36. And that's uh, right here. And then Walmart, I spent $61.93. So I'm pretty sure people will pick the option to go to Walmart. You guys seen the items that I got, but you know, I want to please both crowds. The people that can go to Sam Club and can get those things that I have, or people that just on a fixed income and have bigger families and can't make it to Sam Club. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much. If you haven't subscribed to me, please, like, comment, and subscribe. I really do appreciate you. You're a return subscriber. Bye.